everybody. Club Pro Guy here coming to you live from the Club Pro Guy Learning Center. You know, as players, sometimes we get so wrapped up in our golf swing that we ignore other important parts of the game that can make the difference between winning shop credit and going home empty handed. Today, I want to talk about one of those situations. It's late in the final round of the C Flight Club Championship, and you're down two shots net. Your opponent nuts one about 230 down the right side, but gets cocky and goes for a 170 yard carry over water on a second shot and ends up blowing it dead left into the shit. As he races to the search area to look for his ball, the big question is, what do you do? Instinctively, you want to sit in your cart and thumb through your phone praying that three minutes fly by, but let's face it, that could be a bad look. In an effort to show sportsmanship, we got to help this guy look for his ball. But we need to be strategic about it because actually finding the ball is not an option. We need to give this guy what I call the figure eight. Let's take a much closer look at this search area. Every time I encounter a search area, I divide it into two quadrants. Quadrant A, where I believe the ball is, and quadrant B. We want to set up camp in the lower left-hand corner of quadrant B in a sub-quadrant where we will perform our figure eight. Let's take a closer look at this all-important sub-quadrant. Ball searches are all about motion. As long as your competitor sees you're moving, you're golden. So we're going to perform a classic figure eight search in this small confined space for the duration. Over and over, we go into, we go into figure eight. We'll do this as long as he wants to search for the ball. Lap after lap after lap. When your competitor finally calls off the search, congratulations. He just took a stroke and distance penalty and you showed tremendous sportsmanship. For more information on playing to win, stop by the Learning Center or visit me at clubproguy.com.